All right, welcome back to another episode of Spider-Man Remastered. And uh, yeah, today we will be getting the new advanced suit and replacing the classic suit. So uh, yeah, let's just get right into it. Looks like Doc's gone for the night. Time to sneak in some spider work. All right, let's see what we have here. What is this? Oh, it's one of those puzzles. Yeah, I'm going to skip that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. All right, yeah, let's just go into the, into this thing, into the room. Parker, Doctor Octavius, I, uh, uh, what you got there? Chinese. If I know you'd be here, I would. have... What are you working on? Oh, just a side project. Of course. It's you. I, uh, I, I don't know what oh, you're... Oh, come on, Parker. It's obvious. L let me explain. I only wish you'd told me sooner. I wanted to. But I was afraid that if word got out, my family might be in danger. Huh. Yes. Uh, I guess if you design his equipment, you're bound to be a target, too. Yeah. Um, yeah. Don't worry. Your secret's safe. Well, I'll leave you to it. Check your email. This isn't how Doc fires me. You know, the new Peter Parker face model is kind of, kind of growing on me. Not that we're not there yet, but the only thing that I'm having an issue with right now is that the eyes look very uncanny. Like, <laughs> it looks kind of creepy, I'm not going to lie. But it's kind of growing on me. Uh, before we go into the computer, I will mention that this scene, I normally, by the way, I normally don't go into these sort of things when I'm playing. But this scene in particular is probably one of my favorites because uh, it just goes to show that um, basically Octavius already knows that Peter is Spider-Man. The moment he saw the suit and Peter, he put the puzzle pieces together, basically. Uh, and he lies to Peter in a sense to protect them. He tells him that, oh, you're just a suit maker. But he knows he's Spider-Man. He's not the suit maker. It's obvious. And uh, the only reason why he does that is because he wants to protect Peter and, uh, in a sense, protect him from him getting even more worried about people that know his identity, in a sense. Because uh, since Peter mentioned it, that he's doing it for his family, you know, that's when Octavius basically said, oh, okay, you know, like, I'm just going to lie to this dude. Uh, keep it, keep keep him a bit safe, in a sense. And uh, I'll, you could also tell by, like, the subtle, like, like directing choices, how they... Uh, pause and stuff like that but uh anyways i'm just rambling on let's just get right into the uh into the main event what we're here for for the new advanced suit peter the revelation of your second job as spider-man suit crafter is that the right term <clears throat> is a reminder of the good man and partner you are no matter how hard you work you still find time to help others i hope you don't mind but i noticed the suit was a bit damaged and I took the liberty of sketching up some of my own improvements. Attached are a few ideas I had on how you could enhance his suit and help protect Spider-Man, who does so much for this city. Looking forward to the incredible work that we are doing and changing the world together. Your partner and friend, Otto. Uh, I'm going to say one more thing, though, that uh, the previous thing we just had with Peter and Otto, uh, it's also a really good scene because... Um, you know, you find a new meaning of that and how Otto already knew Peter Parker was Spider-Man um, when the betrayal comes. And, you know, and I feel like that becomes even more hard hitting. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm getting way too ahead of myself there. White spider, huh? Hmm. You can now use tokens to create that advanced suit. Press X to continue. All right. So there it is. All right. Let's get it. I gotta say that the advanced suit in this game looks very, very nice. Um, I've always been a fan of it. 
The only issue I had in the original version of the game is that the red portions of the suit like had this orange tint to it and uh, it kind of looked weird. But uh, over here it looks red. It looks decent. It doesn't look bad. Uh, I kind of wish it was a bit more like red, like a bit more vibrant. But overall, it's not bad suit at all. Uh, let's see, new suit, suit power. Okay, so yeah, we know about the suit powers and uh, suit mods. I'm just gonna skip that. That should do it. Oh yeah, that that never gets old. That's almost as uh, nostalgic as the uh, as the intro sequence of the game. All right, let's see what we have here. All right, so before I end the video, I will mention a couple things. Hold up, I'm just waiting for that radio because it always cuts me off. There it is. Spider-Man, I think I figured out how Fitz's men are keeping his rackets running. Construction site. Wasn't that shut down when he was arrested? No, it's one of his legitimate businesses. Multiple investors. We can't act without cause. But now you've got that, right? That's why I'm hoping you can keep an eye on the locations. Tell me if you see anything suspicious. You got it. I'll be your nosy neighborhood Spider-Man. Yeah, so what I was going to talk about was that when this suit first appeared uh, on screen, I remember there was a huge division between the fans. Like, some people liked it. I was part of that group, and uh, some people didn't like it so much. Um, a lot of people that didn't like it said that it was a far cry from what we have with the classic suit, basically. And uh, they didn't like the white. It looked too armory, and apparently it looked very athletic. And I can see that that's not really a big issue. I feel like that's what they were trying to go for. Like, make something different. And I feel like Insomniac definitely succeeded in that department. And uh, due to that, this suit has become a, like iconic you know uh, i think it's made a movie debut in the miles morales uh into the spider-verse movie i think it was in there as a suit and i think in the new movie it's also gonna appear you know so it's definitely uh reached a level of popularity that could rival some of the suits in the comics and uh i could definitely say that it's probably one of my top three favorite suits of all time for spider-man and uh, yeah, that's about it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, let me know what you guys thought when you guys first saw this outfit, this cool ass suit. And uh, yeah, leave it down in the comments and I'll definitely see you guys next time. Peace.